given that fx is equal to px plus q and f3x is equal to 8x minus 7, find the value of p and q. So here fx is equal to px plus q. So f3x is equal to 8x minus 7. So to compare, we, make, we need to make it equal, make equal function. So now we have fx. So we know that first fx, then we can change to f, fx, which is equal to f2x, and then f2x. When we make it fx inside, we will get f3x. So you see here, this is the first step, second step, and then third step. So we have to find 1, 2, 3 to get f3 so that we can compare so that we can compare so a fx is equal to px plus q so f fx so you see here f fx is equal to so when we change this one to x to fx so this one will need to change to fx to so p fx plus q which is equal to we have fx which is px plus q so p px plus q plus q so here we get p square x plus pq plus q so now we have f2x is equal to p to p square x plus pq plus q so f3x f3x is equal to f2 fx which is equal to, so we see here x, we change to fx. So here we get p square fx plus pq plus q. So here we get p square fx is equal to px plus q. So here px plus q plus pq plus q. So here we get p3x plus p square times q, we get p square q plus pq plus q. So now we get f3x, f3x is equal to, here lah, p square x plus p square q plus pq plus q. So we can compare, we have this one and this one. So we can see, we, we compare in front of x with in front of x and without x, with without x. So we can see here that p3, p cube is equal to 8. So p is 2. So here, p square q plus p q plus q is equal to negative 7. And we know that p is equal to 2. So 2 square is 4 q plus 2q plus q is equal to negative 7. So here we see here 7q is equal to negative 7. Negative 7, q is equal to negative 1. So here, p is equal to 2. And then, q is equal to negative 1. So this is a. So B, determine the function F4. Determine the function F4. So, for B, we know that Fx is equal to Px plus Q, where P is 2, Q is minus 1. So, we get here 2x minus 1. So, F4, F4 is also equal to F3, Fx. Where we, we already have F3. So, F3 is equal to 8x minus 7. So, here, F3x is equal to 8x minus 7. So, F3, Fx is equal to 8Fx minus 7. So, here, 8, Fx is equal to 2x minus 1 minus 7. So here we get 16x minus 8 minus 7. So 16x minus 15. See, by studying the pattern f, 
F2, F3, F4 determine the general rule when n is the number of time. So, this is Fn. So, this is Fx. So, F2x is equal to P is 2. So, we get 4x. P plus P is 2. Q is negative 1 plus negative 1. So, we get 4x. So, this one minus 2 minus 1. We get 4x minus 3. So, we can compare. So, we see here Fx. So, Fx is equal to 2x minus 1 f2x is equal to 4x minus 3 f3x is equal to 8x minus 7 and f4x is equal to 16x minus 15 so what is the pattern so, f and x is equal to, so we see here in front of x, so this is all x, so this one is x, so in front of x, so you see here this one is, so this is the, see, uh, the power of 2, this is 2 to the power of 1, 2 the, to the power of 2, 2 to the power of 3, and this one is 2 to the power of 4, so you see here 2 to the power of 1, we get 2, 2 to the power of 2, we get 4. 2 to the power of 3, we get 8. And 2 to the power of 4, we get 16. So, we see it. We can say this one is 2 to the power of n. So, the back here, you see here, this one is negative 1. So, negative 1 is equal to negative 2 plus 1. So, here, negative 4 plus 1, we get negative 3. Negative Negative 8 plus 1, we get negative 7. And this one is negative 16 plus 1, we get 15. So, that means that, because same with the front one, so we get minus 2n, and then we add with 1. So, this is the fn. So, for example, if they ask for f, 10x. So, we can just substitute 2 to the power of 10x minus 2, 10 plus 1. So, we can just get the answer. So, it's 